friends, so it's just me. Danica's just walking around, um, entertaining herself. But um, um, I just did a video with Miss Danica of the the brand new catalog, the spring and summer collection, new scents, new release scents. And so I just did that, and then now I'm gonna go into the spring and summer. There is one, two, three, four, five, five, ten, fifteen. There are twenty cents. Twenty cents. <laughs> so I want to go ahead and, and get started on that. Okay. I'm sorry, friends. I apologize. I had I was missing one cent, and that was a a cent from last catalog that came back from the new release. Okay. So. I want to go through this like really quick. This is a spring and summer, so it's not a brand, brand new, brand new scents. These are scents that um, moved around the catalog, um, or um, from previous catalog, or that was in the spring and summer from last last time. So, uh, first one is Aloha Citrus. Since it says Aloha Citrus is a fresh tide of tangerine, jade, blossom, and vetiver, vetiver. So, I do, I do remember that one. I think that was like a brand new, new release scent last spring. And I do like that one, I remember now. Um, very refreshing. A fresh tide of tangerine jade blossom and vit vitiver. I don't know what vitiver smells like, but Aloha Citrus. Um, I like it. Um, it's a, it's, it's a bar that I have a couple of from last year, last spring and summer. Um, it's not too citrusy. It, it's more like a punchy. I call, uh, okay, so <laughs> I love, okay, the way I'm going to describe this is based on, like, of course, my scent and how I like it. So not all of us have the same same taste though in scents so I have always been more of like a clean and breezy a citrusy um, very tropical scent I love my tropical clean and breezy clean scents refreshing like spa feel kind of thing those those are my go-to scent that's what draws me and then lately I have also been really loving the bakery scent the sweetness of of caramel and vanilla and um, cheesecake and just the sweetness of the bakery scent not necessarily too much of the spiciness of the bakery but more of like the um, the the sweetness of it um, I'm not too much into like the strong woodsy or the mm, like the the like the 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 woodsy tone or musky I'm not into too much of that so when when it when it's a scent that I like it's it's based on those terms <laughs> and there's nothing wrong with the woodsy or the musky it's just not something that my nose automatically attracts to so okay with that being said I do like Aloha Citrus um, it's it's fresh and clean but not too citrusy I want to say it has a bit of like a like a frothy, like a milky base to it. Like that scent. So I'm just gonna stick with that one. Berry of Paradise was our one of our scents of the month. And I, I forgot what it when it was. I want to say August. Was it August? But this is a scrumptious, since it says it is a scrumptious sugared strawberry, bird of paradise, and vanilla bean. So I'm so glad that this made it to the spring and summer collection. Because I missed out on purchasing this, uh, this when it was available, and very sweet. So if you guys like the the sweetness, it's so sweet. It's very very sweet. Um, sugared strawberry. Okay, it tastes more like a like a strawberry puree, and then sugar was added to it, and then boiled, and then that's all your kitchen smells. It's just that sugary strawberry so I like it it smells really good but very very sweet so if you like that kind of scent coastal strawberry I'm so glad oh friends when I saw that this made it to the spring and summer catalog I was so happy because this coastal strawberry was my first regret the whole year 
was my first regret because this was only available for a very limited of time like during the summer I bought one bar but I did not melt that one bar until later on down a couple months later and when I did I'm like I want more of this I really want more of this so I will definitely stock I will have 10 bars of this at least by the time spring and summer catalog is done because when I melted this it was um, it 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 just smelled gosh it just it just smelled like childhood field of strawberry dreams oh, earthy fruity strawberry vine and raspberry seeds over jasmine petals is how Sensi describes this this is strawberry but not like the bird of paradise that had strawberries in it it's not overpowerly sweet it has that vanilla creamy tone to it but even though it doesn't say vanilla I just feel like it has a vanilla creamy tone to it but it just smells so good it just feels like a field of strawberries mmm so good okay definitely this is one of my favorites for the spring and summer collection of the new one of the new one this year because I have like I have three of my favorites in here that's just the tropical okay We'll get to that when we get to that. Pineapple sorbet. Since it says pineapple sorbet is sweet and tart, like a refreshing scoop of pineapple sorbet. Okay, friends. Pineapple sorbet. I have a couple bars of this from last year. And like I said, I've smelled every single one of this when I was trying to organize it. Oh my gosh. This smells so good. This smells like just pineapple sorbet that that fruity that fruity ice cream without all the the cream base to it ah oh, it smells really really good it smells like pineapple like like sweetness of like over ripened pineapple it smells really really good if you guys like pineapple scent definitely pick this one up okay shimmer okay shimmer shimmer was part of our um so um, during the December uh, it came out December 1st two brick bars came out which was shimmer and sugar and both of those made it into the spring and catalog and I am so thrilled because shimmer is just an amazing scent it's just so girly it's just it just it's the perfect thing or perfect fragrance to describe girly scent you know okay sweet cherries velvety apricots and sensual white musk crowned with a tiara of shimmering spun sugar it just smells really really good it's just very girly if you like the I don't even I don't, it's not even like a florally girly scent it's more like a light perfume scent but if you want a girly girly like scent this is the one really I'm really happy with the brick and I'm, I'm so glad that um, it came out for the um, a spring and summer catalog to get into a bar flower child is another scent that I have a couple bars of from last spring and summer since it says flower child is sweet red berries layered over wild uh, gardenia and sandalwood mmm okay because it is such a small it's flower it's very floral okay remember that now it's a floral it's a sweet floral scent if you like that kind and then it has a bit of like a powdery tone to it um it smells really good so it, it's it smells again another girly scent if you like the the floral the flower the powdery sweetness uh, the red berries it smells really good so that's another go-to for me I do have a couple bars of that go go mango oh, okay so starting next month I will be ordering the laundry line I'm debating of if I should get I talked about this on my last video about the VIP program there is a VIP program for laundry so you can have an option of ordering whenever you need it like every month every other month kind of thing and then it also gives you an option to order a brick. I talked about that in my other videos and a couple videos before, but 
I have been waiting because I was going to order it like this month, but I'm like, no, I'll wait. Um, laundry line. I want to try their laundry line for my sheets. It will be available in Gogo Mango. So Gogo Mango is a juicy mango and melon garnished with hibiscus and sweet banana flower. It smells really good. Um, you can smell that that little hint of mango in there with that melon and the hibiscus flower. Oh, we used it in the Philippines when my dad was stationed in the Philippines. We had hibiscus flower all over our, our yard. It smells amazing. Oh, I love that smell. Okay. Okay. This is, I cannot wait. I'm going to order some bars of this along with the, um, the laundry line. Okay. So, Habana Cabana. Okay. Havana Cabana is one of my ultimate favorite tropical scents. So I have three of them and they're all, they all made it. Did they all make it here? I want to say they all did. Oh, where's my other one? Okay. So my other one made it. So I love Kamu Kamu, Kahiku Hula, and Havana Cabana. Oh my gosh. Those are like the three. If, if Sensi ever goes away with those three scents, I will quit. Sensi, I'm telling you. Whew, I I love this is why I'm here this is why I love Scentsy is because this Havana Cabana a luscious medley of pineapples and oranges and bananas and berries it is tropical as tropical as you can be oh, perfect I can't even describe it it's just tropical it's just uh, a Mai Tai in your hand out in paradise of like 85 degree weather all sunshine and just on vacation that's what that smells like okay sugar like I said we had during December we had two bricks sugar and shimmer sugar is fruit fruity blend of lemon drops and cotton candy oh this is burning right now into um, one of my warmers the star flower warmer the star flower warmer is absolutely gorgeous it is um also burning melting not melt burning melting here into my blue crush warmer it just smells so clean and girly and oh it's just oh, it's just sweetness but not overly sweet it's just oh, it's just it's like when miss danica was here in my previous video it's just the essence of being girly little girly girl sweetness oh my goodness love that love sugar okay summer holiday since it says summer holiday is bursting with lush plumeria one of my favorite flowers um tiger lily and sweet orange softened by van uh, by vanilla and radiant amber plumeria and hibiscus are my ultimate favorite flower oh my gosh this smells so good Sweet smell, clean, refreshing, very nice. It's it's a very nice overall, like this is spring. This is when you melt this, it's like spring is here, spring has arrived. Okay, that's a good scent. I have a couple of bars of that as well from last um, last catalog of spring and summer. Kahiku Hula, OMG friends. For all my friends that loves tropical scent, this this is the first scent I ever got that made me fell in love with Sensi Kahiko Hula, and until this day, that was like what five years. I've I've always had Kahiko Hula. Say aloha with exotic passion fruit, mango, and papaya. This this is just on vacation, Hawaii. That's it. You're on vacation. Kahiku hula. This, kahiku hula. This is when my girls dance hula. When hubby and I dance hula. This, this is what radiates. This is what shines. And this is what I smell. Ah, oh, kahiku hula. Okay. Love that. Love, love, love that. All time favorite. Kahiku hula in Havana, Cabana. Okay, next one we have lemon sorbet. Okay, lemon sorbet, since it says it is a fresh cut lemon and, I'm sorry, I'm looking down. Lemon uh, and grapefruit zest sweetened by sugar cane. I have, it's like a nice angle to where like, cause you guys, I can't see. I need glasses. 
So with the glare, it's just a perfect um, lemon sorbet. Okay, sweetened by sugar cane. This smells so good too. I have a couple bars of this as well. I stocked up last spring and summer. I was so afraid that there was some scents that was not going to come back. Lemon sorbet is very subtle. It's perfect for the bathroom. It's perfect for the kitchen when it's um, oh, just to make it like after you clean your kitchen, after you clean, not when you're frying fish. <laughs> so friends, if you guys have watched my videos, I hate the smell of fish, but I love fried salmon. Jonathan love fried. I will cook a salmon like this. It'll be gone. No leftovers. But I hate the smell of it, and so I'll just open up windows. It doesn't matter if it's free. I just did that tonight. Freezing temperature. I'll open up windows. And then I'll clean my kitchen. Once it's all clean, once the fan is on, aired out, kind of thing, I'm like, okay. To make me really feel like it's clean, lemon sorbet. It's just a good scent. It's perfect for the bathroom. Perfect for a laundry room. Perfect for a small space because this scent, though, it's very light, so it's not good unless you put probably three or four and I'm, I'm too too cheap for that I use one or two bars when I put two or two cubes when I put um, two cubes it's because it needs two cubes but that's as far as I'll go I will not put three no four no five that's just no I can't do that I'd rather change it the next day and just enjoy it for a full eight hours than put in five five cubes it smells good. It's perfect. It's good for a kid's room. Um, it's very light. Um, I've used this into my girl's room. So got that. Next one is lemon or uh, verbana. Okay. I, I went through lemon verbana during the winter. And it was constantly in my bathroom. It is a good, it's a strong scent. It's a good performer. And it's clean, like just clean. It's just lemon. It's, it's just lemon. Fresh lemon zest, bright lime, and bourbonna leaf. It's just like a like a lemon lime put together and put into a bowl and you're just melting it. It's just straight up lemon lime. Not citrusy. It's just good. It's a good performer. It's really good. I don't mind buying a couple more um, bars of this because it is really... It's a strong performer and it lasts a long time. Okay, Summer Soleil, is that how you pronounce it? Pineapple and coconut milk top fluffy vanilla marshmallow. Okay, I know I have a couple bars of this. Yes. It's sweetness and creamy and frothy. Pineapple and coconut milk. It, it, ta it tastes, it smells. It smells really good. It's summer soleil. Again, this is one of those light scents, so I I feel that it's for a smaller room. Lemon Vervana, you can put into a big room and then it'll perform really well with just one cube. This one, creamy tone, it's it's an absolutely gorgeous scent. It's it's beautiful. Um, I do recommend this as well, but it, it's a light scent. Okay, so you might have to go two bars, maybe three. I can't do three though. Okay, summer sunshine. Pineapple and coconut basked in a warm mandarin glow. Another good scent. Mm, I think it's that coconut. The coconut here, these two, the summer soleil and the summer sunshine, both has pineapple, both has coconut, but the coconut here is more overpowering which is the summer sunshine than the other one the other one it's more of a creamy frothy this one has that that strong coconut um, note to it smells good okay lilacs and violet is another favorite of mine since it says perfect combination of lilacs and violets the smell of spring okay yes if you like lilacs this is very um, strong. It's not subtleness at all. It's um, I have a couple bars of this from last catalog, last spring and summer, and it is it's a strong one. It's good to have even in a size room like this one. This is my studio. 
and this is supposed to be like a regular size living room it would one cube is perfect for an eight hour scent I like that mm, really like that you can really you can smell the notes of the lilacs and the violets okay hmm okay so lush gardenia is another uh, favorite because I love Sampaguita. Sampaguita is the uh, flower of the Philippines, the national flower. And to me, Sampaguita and Jasmine are very similar, although they're not the same, but they're very, very similar. Very, uh, very um, fragrant. Again, this is a, a powerful floral scent. Even one cube in this room is plenty. And it lasts a long time as well. So since it says the creamy, full scent of classic gardenia with a whisper of, is it tuber, tuber rose? So it has some, the, the rose hint to it. it smells really good. Um, I always gift this as well, the gardenia. So got that. Paradise Punch. Paradise Punch, since it says it's a medley of wild Indian orange and sunny lemon juice, acia berries, and star fruit. I have tasted star fruit um, when I was a kid in the Philippines and I loved it. Sour though, woo! I like this too. Paradise Punch, I have a couple bars of this. Mmm. A medley of wild Indian orange and sunny lemon juice, acia berries. It's just it's just all those goodness all mixed together. It's just it's just a bowl of goodness. It smells really good. Another another favorite of mine. Really good. Sweet cucumber. I do have a couple bars of this. I like cucumber scents. I think cucumber is just a nice refreshing scent. Since it says uh, sweet sweet cucumber is fresh, apple blossoms, green melon, and sugared citrus mingle with a splash of cucumber water. Yes. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Apple blossoms, green melon. <sighs> Smells really, really good. If you like that clean, refreshing, like spa feel, this one. This one's a good scent. It's, it's clean. It's just, it's perfect for a bedroom, perfect for an office, perfect to take with you to work kind of thing. It's not overpowering. It's just Sometimes it's hard to take scents to work because, like I said, um, we all have different senses, senses. but um, when you bring in uh, a scent to work and it's just mild and mellow, everyone seems to be okay with it, and this is one of those. You can't go wrong with that. Okay, Vanilla Oud, that's the one I was looking for earlier. Vanilla Oud was our new release last fall and winter, and it made it here to the spring and summer catalog, but they brought it into the the spring and summer title which I don't I know I didn't buy a bar of this so I don't hmm I actually like it I don't know why I thought it would be over in the classic section or the cafe corner cafe sweet vanilla grounded by leather and earthy oud wood I don't know what oud wood smells like but this actually smells really good. I'm surprised I did not buy a couple of bars of this. Maybe because there was just so many fall winter scents that I just overlooked this. Oh, friends, it's just, it smells really good. Okay, that is the spring and summer collection. Um, um, I like every single one of this. Just like the new release, I like every single one. I'm always so thrilled when spring and summer comes because of the, the new you know new scents, new bars, new items. I cannot wait to actually like go through the catalog with you guys and, and go through the scents. I do want to go and maybe talk about the classics and the Darling and Dashing Corner Cafe before the month is out. I'm hoping that I can get to that. Um, but I really wanted to talk about the new scent in the spring and summer for those of you guys that order through me or any other consultants and you're just ordering through the websites. It's actually really hard to order when you don't, like when you haven't, you can read what it says and be like, okay, maybe that's good. But when someone's actually smelling it, when they're telling you like, yeah, I kind of like the 
spring and summer and the tropical and you're like oh me too so then if she likes it maybe I like it too and just because I don't like something that doesn't necessarily mean that it doesn't smell good because if it made it into the catalog believe me it smells amazing but I just prefer a certain variety of scents um, but I do want to try to go through the other scents to join is $99 but for the month of uh, for the month of February, we got a couple more days left. It is 49, so you get the 80 testers, you get the business um, pamphlets, brochures, all that, everything you need to do to run your business. And then, as I showed into my other video, you do get this amazing warmer. Look at this. This is the Star Dance Warmer. The warmer itself is already $50, but the whole deal you're getting for $49 plus three months of your free website after that it's just ten dollars a month really honestly friends I I love being a sensei consultant so if you guys have any questions let me know um, I wanna I wanna do a, a maybe two more videos of the sense if you guys don't mind I hope that's okay because I do have some new recruits I do have some um, new members of my team and this is why I'm making this video especially for them but especially for my customers as well that orders through me I want I want you guys to know what the um, scent smells like what the what the items look like what the warmers look like so when I feel like when I'm showing it to you guys then you have a better understanding of one look see how you know compared it to just the catalog itself or just the website but um bear with me for my friends that don't usually watch my sensi videos i will get back to the recipes um i have a couple of recipes that i want to share with you guys a couple of products that i want to share with you guys but for now because march 1st that's when all these new releases coming out i do have um, a lot of uh, questions being asked about Sensi products and I want to make sure I do answer that for my girls that are new especially them because they are new and they're relying on me to to give them information and I have um, I have Jennifer I believe she joined yesterday or the other day um, so she is all the way from another state and it's hard for us to you know for me to communicate with her if you have any questions Jennifer please feel free to watch any of the videos contact me i'm here to help you out in any way i can okay friends i'm gonna end this for now as always thank you guys for visiting a simply simple life mahalo